All right, we have a fan favorite returning at Moe's, and we have some other changes going on at Moe's. I'll explain in a minute. Cue the intro. What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive. All right, so I visited my local uh, Moe's. Uh, you can check it out right there. I did make it a Moe's day. In this bag is just all of this, uh, I always say free chips, tortilla chips. You can see right there. Uh, but then I'll have some comments that's saying, no, they're not free because you paid for a uh, burrito that comes with the chips, but not every place gives you the chips. You know there's one place out there that makes you pay for the chips and the price of the burritos over at Moe's are not higher than the other guys and they're giving you the chips. So in my opinion, they're free chips. That's just one man's opinion, my two cents. Uh, but I did get a burrito as well. This is a chicken burrito. I went with both uh, chicken options. They sell two chicken options over at Moe's. Uh, I added the free vegetables, the uh, peppers, onions, and mushroom, the Southwestern ranch sauce, uh, sour cream, cheese, and uh, I think that's it, rice and no beans. But this is not the star of the show. We might be using that uh, as a vessel to dip into what is the star of the show. Uh, they've returned a fan favorite right here in this bowl. This is their chili con queso. This is their white gold queso, their signature white gold queso. And then they're going to add some seasoned ground beef and jalapeno. So let's get this open. While I'm getting this open, I noticed that um, Moe's is actually in the middle of a revamp. Uh, they've actually changed their menu. The items are all still the same, but the names of the items are gone. Uh, at least all of them except one. The uh, burrito I got today is the Home Wrecker. Comes with guacamole. I think I forgot to mention that. Uh, but the Home Wrecker is the only one on the menu left that had the uh, unique names. What was it? John Coctosin, uh Earmuffs, and uh, the Joey Bag of Donuts. I think a lot of people are going to be sad that uh, Joey Bag of Donuts is off the menu. I just love saying I'd like to order a Joey Bag of Donuts. Um, so they did not change anything. They just took the names off. I think the Joey Bag of Donuts uh, burrito is just up there as burrito. But they are doing a revamp uh, with everything over at Moe's, and I like the direction they're going. So I don't want to spill this all over the car. I'm going to see if you can get uh, a look at that. That is some chili con queso. So let me go right into this. Here we go. This is a fan favorite. I've never tried it. This cup, believe it or not, was seven bucks. The burrito was $7.49. That's right. I spent 16 or 17 bucks at uh, Moe's and it is what it is. That is a thick chili con queso. Look at that. All right. Wish me luck. Chili con queso back uh, returning Moe's Southwest uh, Grill. Let's go. Mm. Mm. All right, so listen, I'm going to keep it real. Uh, if you're new to the channel, uh, I'm a huge fan of Moe's. I endorse Moe's frequently. It is very rare that I get something uh, that I do not enjoy from Moe's. Uh, the one thing about this, the flavor's on point. Nice jalapeno, the flavor of the beef, and their white gold uh, queso is legit. One of the top uh, quesos in the game. It's just a little watery. I mean, there is some consistency with the beef. It's just a little bit on the uh, watery side but it still does have some thickness. I wanted it to just be a little bit uh, thicker. That's just me probably nitpicking a little bit, but the flavor's on point. If you love queso, you throw in the seasoned beef and uh, voila, the jalapenos too, giving it that little bit of spice. Uh, second bite. Mm. Yeah, yeah, this is good. I'm glad I got the bowl. I think the cup of this is $3.99, so I'm like, let's go. Seven bucks, bowl, out the door. What was I doing? I was staring at it. Mesmerized. It had me captivated. But, um, all right, let's get another chip out. I think I might want to dip my um, burrito into this. What do you think? Got to dip my burrito into that? Oh, yeah, there's some nice chunks of jalapeno in there. Ooh. All right, let's see if you can get a close-up of that right there check it out 
Yeah, that's chili con queso, Mo style. All right, check out this bad boy. I was watching them fill this up and they did not skimp. This is a hefty, hefty, hefty burrito. Check it out one more time. Uh, we're just gonna do a little dip action. I'm gonna take this uh, chili con queso and we're gonna do what we do. We are going to dip, so I'm excited. Ooh, I gotta be careful. I have to be careful. Probably not the best thing to do in the car. But, whoa, oh, there it is. Ooh, dip and drip. Let's go. Double fisted. Yeah, that adds such a great flavor to an already existing flavorful burrito. Uh, you can see the insides right there. I'm gonna take another bite of the burrito, but um, we're here for the chili con queso. That has great flavor, a nice cheesiness. Uh, like I said, the white gold queso is legit over at uh, Moe's, and you're gonna throw some seasoned beef and uh, jalapenos into the mix. What could go wrong? So let me take another bite of this burrito because we got a lot happening over here. I ate it like a caveman. A lot of stuff was going on. So I wanna even this off, wrap it back up, give you a rating, and move on with the day. It's what we're gonna do. So last bite, we'll give this uh, chili con queso a rating. Let's go. Oh, Paul. <laughs> All right, so let's rate this, shall we? On a scale of one to 100, with one meaning don't even waste your money, and 100 being the promised land of... I'm going to give the chili con queso returning from Moe's a rating of... That's good. That is very good. I can see why it's a fan favorite. That's a 92. I really do enjoy that. That would be in that 95, 96 range if it came just a little bit thicker. Uh, and I think, what was the place out there? Was it Chili's? They would give you the chili con queso in a skillet. I always liked that back in the day. I haven't had that in a while, but that stacks right up there with some really great uh, chili con queso. So there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media, getting the word of my channel out to the masses. In closing chili con queso are you a fan are you going to be checking this out over at mo's based on my recommendation tell them the endorsement sent you uh, they won't know what you're talking about All right, bonus footage. I think what happened, um, they have a regular bag of chips right here with a smaller amount of chips, still a decent amount that came with the uh, burrito. Then you have that huge bag of chips that I believe are part of the uh, chili con queso purchase. Uh, so for seven bucks, like I said, you're getting this, uh, but you're also getting a huge bag of uh, tortilla chip. I was wondering why I got two bags of chips. Now it all makes sense. So uh, thank you for joining me on this uh, Moe's review, chili con queso. I hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you soon with some more reviews. Bye. Yeah, yeah.